Hello, welcome. Welcome to another Riding with Tom. Actually, I'm changing everything. I'm, I'm not doing motorcycles anymore. I'm doing cooking, so welcome to Cooking with Tom. Today, I'm doing a, a nice fillet steak. And uh, no, I freaked that. I'm doing a, a video on my setup. My helmet, my camera, uh, and my other fun, cool toy that I just got, which was a, a Bluetooth uh, communicator. Um, headset, music streaming, phone thing, does lots of things, it's really cool. But here's my helmet, uh, to start off this is a uh, AGV uh, K3 helmet with some crazy design thing. Um, camera I use, Drift HD, awesome camera, does the freaking trick. Uh, I haven't upgraded to the Ghost yet. Uh, because I've heard issues with it and stuff and you know I haven't seen the real need to I don't use the remote uh, I just when I'm get on my bike I press on I get off my bike I press off you know if I went on a long trip maybe that would be good but uh, you know I'm still rocking the HD so it just works it's never corrupted a file it's never run out of batteries and you know lost a file it's always been used to error I haven't charged it or I haven't turned it on or this and that so that's why I'm still using the Drift HD. So I run the Drift HD mic, uh, which comes through. Uh, that's pretty freaking dark in there, actually. Let me just smash this outside. More light outside. Is that steak going? Is that steak going? Yeah, she's all right. She's all right. All right. So uh, mic comes out of here. My helmet's pretty ghetto. I can't really take out the padding, so I have duct tape and shit, but I don't care. When I get a new helmet, it'll all be done. Cable managed. Cable managed as well as my computer's are cable managed, but uh, the cable comes out, loops around inside my helmet, and actually, it actually comes through the microphone in. I have it buried deep into there, uh, just because to stop wind noise. Wind noise is so hardcore, so the mic is actually, if I pull it out, that's what she said. Uh, yeah, that's the drift mic. It's buried really far into there just so I can stop as much wind noise as possible because oh, it just kills it, wind noise. So that's my drift setup. There it is again. And then my new thing that I got is the Interphone F5. So that's like a Bluetooth um, uh, music player, you know, telephone thing. Uh, uh, intercom. Uh, my friends have got it as well. We've been riding around together. I'll smash in a little bit of footage of us bombing around. Okay. Why don't you just easily turn your bike around, hole zinger? I'm doing that. Feel the earth moving, earthquake. <laughs> All right. Let's race! Big slips. Up Collins Street. Wop how Ganhouse style. I think we can. We've got to do that somehow. Except I want to. I want to choose the music, not drum, not Holzinger. I don't want freaking. <laughs> Death metal in my ears. Yeah, your front brake brake fluid. Why is it blue? Is it meant to be blue? Your front brake fluid. It's blue. Uh, they just put freaking Gatorade in it, man. And they charge yeah, charge you a hundred bucks of blue Gatorade. Um, but how that is set up? So I've got it stuck on there. Easily takes off and stuff just with this cable. And again, some more freaking blue ta uh, duct tape. And then comes in. And then it's got speakers. So one there, one there, and then a microphone, which is. Um, yeah, just in there, right where my mouth gun is. Just because the, the Interphone F5 has really good noise cancellation, so it can be there and it's not really an issue. Um, 
But yeah, the Inter Interphone F5 is really good. It um, it's just it surprised me how good it works. You can use it with your gloves. The range the range is really good. Uh, sound is pretty quality and good volume and everything. So um, yeah, I really like that. Uh, I've been very happy with it. Um, so yeah, that's my helmet. Uh, is that steak going? Bleeding. I'm not. I'm really not very good cook, but I think that's time to, time to flip it over. Ooh yeah, that's pretty good. I like mine. Well done. Yeah, it's going down nicely. So that's my helmet and my camera and everything. Just, just shut the city up for a second. Quiet. Um, so from when it's filmed, uh, then we move on to editing. I'm not going to go into editing because I'm really poor at editing. Um, the writer's life's a lot better than me. But um, so from from filming, I go into uh, raw footage. So my raw footage is housed on a, this 12 terabyte server I have. Um, this is my server and kind of home theater computer. Uh, it's a fanless CPU, pretty much runs dead quiet and uses very low power. Plus has a lot of space. So that's where I keep all my raw footage. And then um, I edit it on this computer, which is my gaming computer. It's a 2600K running at five gigahertz-ish uh, on water cooling and lots of other Corsair fancy things. Um, I'm not the best editor, so I'm not really going to go into editing. I, I don't put a lot of effort into it because I'm, you know, I just haven't really got into editing that much. I am wanting to get into it because, you know, there's other guys out there that are a lot better. I just edited with Sony Vegas. I cut it together, you know. Uh, I'm going to get more into it and shit. I just have to put a bit more effort into it. But, um, yeah, so that's my, that's my rig. Uh, out there was my helmet. Um, that's my setup video. That's my stake. It's burning a bit, but it should be all right. Um, if you have any more questions about, you know, what's up with my helmet, uh, you know, we'll probably be upgrading my camera soon. I still don't know whether to go to the Ghost or something else. I don't really know yet. I just feel that, you know, Rift HD needs a bit of an update. But, um, that's it for now. So, you know, that's it. Have fun. You've been riding with Tom and cooking with Tom. Steak time. Oh, shit.